The impact on our staff was actually, and on the business, was felt immediately. It was a really, really powerful program that Steph put us through, and it just created a whole new energy and a whole new vibe in this business. My name is Peter Rowley. I'm the group CEO of a company called Page Automation. About two years ago, we made a decision to change a number of aspects within our business. We were in a high tech industry, but we really didn't look and feel the part. And getting customers to come to our office was actually more of an embarrassment rather than something that we were proud of. We really hadn't for an, a long time done any work around employees and the type of environment that we wanted to create. I was very fortunate enough to go to a session one morning where I was invited to and Steph was doing a presentation. And even halfway through his presentation, I was just able to resonate with exactly what he was talking about and immediately knew that this is what we needed for our organization. Um, I chatted him after that and within a couple of weeks, we had started the UGR process with Steph. So the process that we followed was really quite straightforward and simple. It's laid out in Steph's book. Um, and we really started off with surveying our, our staff to understand where we were currently and what their perceptions were to try and identify what the problem areas were and what we needed to change. Once we had done that, we were able to have a two-day work session with all of our staff, which we brought up from all over the country, and Steph facilitated a, a workshop. And the way his workshop works are really fantastic because the staff workshop the problems themselves. Steph is just a great uh, facilitator and pushes everybody in the right direction. And it's very powerful because the staff come out having solved the problems with themselves, which is a lot easier than to make the changes and to implement. Once that had been uh, uh, concluded, we were able to get the results out. And from that, we chose 12 or 15 champions within the business to drive this process. Because again, for it to be successful, this had to be a staff process and not a management process that, that we wanted to drive. So we appointed the champions and they then did further workshops in terms of refining and really working down to what were the five or six things that we wanted them as employees and as this company to represent. And around that, we were able to identify our UGRs and develop a whole campaign around how we grow this business with our staff involvement and how we live these UGRs um, to make sure that everybody was on the same page. Suddenly everybody could understand what we stood for and what we were trying to achieve, not only as, as management, but as all employees within this company. And it gave us a common purpose. And the energy that came out about it where, where people were suddenly all pulling in the same direction because we had a common goal and we knew what we had to do, and it was really not complicated at all. From a personal perspective, it was a real eye-opener for me. Because too often we sit in our ivory towers and we actually quite don't understand what's going on in all of our staff's lives. Not only in terms of their business life, but in terms of their personal lives. And it really allowed me to take a step back and to say, wow, this is actually what people are going through. This is what they're experiencing in terms of their personal lives and in terms of their work lives. And it made me have a different focus and it's changed me as a person in terms of actually being able to understand um, the contribution that people make, but sometimes the huge sacrifices that they actually have to make, which is not always recognized. Can I put a total RR on the bottom line? No, that's exceptionally difficult. What I can do is say, the after effects of working in our organization, after we've done the UGRs, there's just a huge change in culture. There's a huge change in people actually want to come to work and people know that they can actually make a difference and that they can hold other people accountable. So in my opinion, you can't actually put a price on that.